Hey guys, iHeartMovies here, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories. Alright, in between episodes, I went ahead and cleared out all the Heartless and all the other rooms I made. And, um, yeah, I made one extra room, the Looming Darkness room here, just started to gain a few extra levels. And I also picked up another Key to Rewards card, which I will be actually handing back to Agrabah after this world. Because once we're on the 10th floor, I'll just teleport back to the 2nd floor, use the Key to Rewards card, and then teleport back to the 10th floor. So it'll be a lot easier that way, and that way I won't have to worry about, um, Making, going through all the rooms of Hollow Bastion again. So today, we are going to head off to the second and third story rooms. Second one is all the way down here, and third one is right up over here. And also, I gained a couple levels last time too. I'm on level 42 now, 290 HP, and 750 card points. And hopefully, we should be able to finish this war today and move on to the 10th floor. I am still surprised at how, how quick I'm going through this game. Because there's only a few more floors after this. Let's see. Here we go. Need a 9. Here we go. Premium room will do. And the key of guidance. Also, I never did mention this earlier, but if you want to skip a scene, just uh, press and hold the start button for a second or two, and then it'll skip it for you. I don't know if I... I don't think I mentioned that earlier, so just so you guys know. And I shall make you scream. Wait, are you gonna make her read My Immortal? Cause that would probably make her scream. Why did Jiminy pop out? He snuck it out. Help. Why, hello there. Well, jeez, that's a little harsh, don't you think? He's trying to help. Yeah, exactly. So this Jiminy did contribute a little bit. No, that's right, yeah, that pretty much is the story for Beauty and the Beast. I haven't seen that movie in forever, not since I was a kid. I missed the Disney movies back then, back in the 90s. Because Disney movies nowadays aren't that great. They're so much better back then. Hmm. Well, apparently, Beast has learned his lesson. Oh, jeez, he's gonna claim his heart? Um, no. Okay, and wait a second. Why aren't we doing anything? Ow. It's like, she she has her back turned to us. We did easily just run up there, or we being Sora, could run up there and just slash her to death with the Keyblade. I don't know why he isn't. So, yeah. Way to go, guys. Way to go. Stand idly by. She's not gonna listen. Villains never do listen when you tell them to. When you tell them to wait, when they teleport away, they they never wait. You think they really would? Uh, no. Oh, so how do you know she went that way? I like the look on Beast's face is like Rawr! kind of like Scooby Doo, but except not really. I do a main Scooby Doo impression. I'll tell you that much. Rawr! Did I just really do that during recording? Yeah, I did. Oh, well, who cares? We have to go help her. Go, Team Sora! Yay, did the key to truth. Let's see, and this brings us right over here, back into the looming darkness. Third story room is right here. I'm going to recreate this room, stand in space, into a uh, moments of pride room. And now I want to change on my death setup too. Because, um. Well, you guys will see in a little bit. <coughs> Excuse me. 
Let's see. Oh, no. Whoops. This is standing space. Okay, yeah, I want to make this room again real quick. There we go. Okay, such. Please tell me I have... I don't have a St. Omemo's Reprive room. Wait a second. Haven't I made one earlier? I want to say that I'm, I did. Oh, perfect. One right up here. Cheers, I don't have any Memo's Reprive cards. Actually, I just realized, is it Memo's Reprive or Memo's Reprieve? I usually say Reprive, but... Nah, I don't know. The save point room. We'll, we'll call it that. And also... Well, I'm not gonna actually not going to do this now. Let me wait until I'm outside... Right outside the door, and then I'll fit on my deck. Okay, here we go. Alrighty. You know, pretty much, uh, you guys can't tell, yeah, there's a boss coming. We'll be fighting Maleficent. As, as, as if that really spoils anything. Uh, pretty much, yeah, all your best attack cards, nothing lower than a 7, really, if you can win it. Sits at the very lowest if you can't. I'm gonna see if I can't get by without any sitses. I don't think I'll be able to. One, two, three, one, two. Yeah, I know this isn't gonna work. Hold on a second. Now, to have the dough for sets is... But generally, yeah, you don't want to have anything lower than 7, but sits is okay, too, so... See, so, yeah, I don't really want to use the line hard. I don't like the fire element with it. Okay, there we go. There, there are 28 attack cards. And then definitely want to bring some cures. One, two, crap. Uh, you know, let me take out the wishing stars, actually. I'm not gonna need those. And then, actually, let me... It's taking longer than I thought it would. Crap. Um, yeah, I'll just do some clever moving around of cards here. Putting the ones in the bottom to fill the gaps that the ones I took out left. And this should not be taking this long. I apologize for it. Crap. Uh, yeah, do, 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 do. There we go. Almost done, guys. One right there. And I really don't care about the order of cards, really. It's no, n really no big deal. So you're there. If you're there. Actually, I think I do have room. Crap, how do I... Let me see. How do I want to go about this? I don't know. Um... Yeah, I'll just put those two last wishing stars in. Definitely put in three cure cards. You'll want very you want you want three high number cure cards at the very least. Round it off with a potion. And yeah, sure, we'll bring in Shadow. Alright then, let's go find Maleficent and Bell. You just need a one equal, and there we go. And Key to Truth. There we go. Sorry we're taking so long with my debt setup. I should probably should have planned it in advance and Yeah, oh well. Well, you didn't really have to do that much. I mean, the rooms are already made for it. You didn't have to find any Heartless, so... Well, apparently, Bell's a smart little cookie. Yeah, can we just, like, get to the fighting? Uh, no. Do not want. Uh, the Jesus boss. If he doesn't play Kingdom Hearts 1, you know what I'm talking about. Alright then guys, so next time on Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories, we will defeat the Dragon Maleficent. This has been I Heart Movie signing off guys, have a nice day and thanks for watching. I hated this boss in Kingdom Hearts 1 so much, such a pain in the ass.